So race 33, it's the Moors Millions, as I said, stairs, legs 14. This is a slightly longer version. So the three miles, seven furlongs, Isabel Reform for Davy Ladd, Emma's Legend February for Pontypool Racing Argus, Sarcat for Davy Ladd, Slip Anchor for Paul O'Neill, Not Now, Never for James Shea, along with Hardy Accord, Blooming Chaser for Darren Thompson, Nay Seeker of Derek Hinton, Southern Set Spectrum for Alex Cherry, Muldoon's Mirage for Martin Leadham, Arbor Lodge and Grand Article. Paul Rhodes and Alex Jerry's, or Mellow Ounces, Martin Liedem and Tambora for Paul Rhodes makes up 14. Looking to qualify for the final in just two weeks' time. Star's got him away. wait. I'll wait for him to settle down. There's probably a couple of these that uh, didn't make uh, the Grand National. Although, a further half a mile, I'm just a bit too long for this lot. They finally settle down if they swing right handed. Get into a straightier a bit. And the far side of the course, it's no secret of Del Hinton that leads them over the second. We'll take that well from Slip Anger of Paul O'Neill's. And then we'll half back to Argus Sarcat. We're up against the fence. It's Darren Thompson's Blooming Chaser. Out wide is Emma's Legend February. Well, three by Paul's Rhodes Tambora. And a couple of greys towards the fence. Isabel Reform and Hardy are called. Martin Needham's Purple Silks on it, or Mellow Ounces and Muldoon's Mirage. Southern Spectrum, oh, we've lost one there, not now, never's gone for James Shea. Unlucky, just I was about to call him. Anyway, Southern Spectrum, and then just the two at the rear of Grand Article and Arbor Lodge. That's the Panker and May's Secret, hand in hand. If we go through the first half mile. Slip Anchor and May's Secret from Blooming Chaser, Argus Sarcat, and Emma's Legend February. And the third group's being led by Tambra, with Hardy Accord, Muldoon's Mirage, Isabel Reform. And Mellow Ounce is in there to so get to the fifth. We'll get over that. Southern Spectrum, and then still the two at the rear are Arbor Lodge and Grand Article. And there's still below the three miles to travel. And Slip Anchor and Mace Secret leave them over the six. We took that well. One that uh, was Argus Sarcat, which is the great in Group 2. Blooming Chaser and Emma Legends of February. And a length and a half back to Tambara and Hardy Accord. Muldoon's Mirage. Why does Alex Cherry's Southern Spectrum? Just on the inside of those are Mellow Ounces. We get to the seventh. And we'll get over that. It's a real few. We just stepped over it. So we're getting a little bit closer order now. The slip Anchor. First one to pass the post with May Secret on his quarters. And then like half back to Blooming Chase, who's taking a little hold for a few strides. And allowed Emma's legend February to draw alongside. And the Argus Sarcat down in fifth now. And followed through by Tambra and Muldoon's Mirage. Get to the eighth. Only a third of the fence is dumped. From home, and slip anchor and lay secret together. And then half back to Emma's legend. Blooming Chaser, Argus, Sarcat, Mondin's Mirage, Tambra. The inside of that is Southern Spectrum. We get to the ninth. Now to all, we've lost one there. Muldoon's Mirage has gone. He shipped his jockey. Looked like he dives forward that time. So he could go under a few more horses' hooves. But the jockey's up. And as you can see, the horse is fine. Because it's uh, running along at the back there. So it's still Slip Anchor and Knee Secret that lead us. From uh, Emma's Legend February Blooming Chase and Argus Sarcat. Pretty much as we were. Not much change. All the real rear is still Grand Article and Isabel Reform. We'll wait till we get down to a business end. As we go over the 11th, Isabel Reform and Arbor Lodge. Both trying to jump it higher than the other. We lost a length or so in doing so. As we go over the 12th. Slip anchor now just by length. May secret. Still Emma's legend February and Blum and Chaser. Although Tambra's moved up now as Argus Sarcat goes back a length or so. Moves up toward, moves on towards the route. Now we'll get over the 13th. So just over half the fence is dumped. And we've still got two miles to travel. And it is Slip Anchor from May Secret. Emma's legend February Blum and Chaser. Chaser. Tambra. Southern Spectrum. The inside Hardy are called the Grey. Next to the very next to that is Argus Sarcrat, which is uh, 
dropped back tamely through the field now. Although we haven't got to the business end, there's still plenty of time to go. We've got our mellow allowances to the 14th. We'll take that as well. Oh, the lodge moved up a little bit now. Grand article and Isabel Riffle. Let's slip anchor, joined by May Secret. And come down to the next. Let's slip anchor and May Secret from Emma's Legend February. We'll skip over the 15th, so we'll 10 more to take. Slip Anchor and Nay Secret from Blooming Chase, Emma's Legend February and Tambra together in Southern Spectrum. Hardy of Gordon or Nello Ounces. Arbor Lodge. Arbor Sacrat. Say Sakart. Sakart. Oh, the one that didn't get over that particularly well was Grand Article. Went straight through the top of it. Lucky to still be on his feet. As they go past the winning post for the last time. One more circuit. Chance to lead. And slip anchor, leading on his own now. As May Secret just drops back to join Blooming Chase Emma's Legend February. And Tambra, Southern Spectrum, and Mellow Ounces. Hardy Accord stepped over that one. Some tired legs here in these horses. And still got a mile to go. Another eight fences. And still slip anchor from Blooming Chase Emma's May Secret Emma's Legend February, Tambra, and Southern Spectrum. Mellow Ounces, Hardy called Isabel Reform, Arbor Lodge, Big Ditch, and all over it, and just the two at the rear now is Argus Sarkart, and Grand Article, strange ride by the jockey on Argus Sarkart, up the front for the first uh, almost mile and a half, and then just dropped back, so we come inside the final mile now, there's a few being pushed along for a few strides, never mind on the game, and it's Slip Anchor, joined by Blooming Chaser and May Secret. So there you one, two, three. And they're followed through by Tambra and there's Legend February. And inside Southern Spectrum. Wide outside now is Isabel Reform as they go to the 20th. So there's another five to take. And it is Blooming Chaser that takes it up now from Slip Anchor on his inside. May Secret on his outside. So it's Blooming Chaser takes them over the 21st. They all take it well. Much closer to the water. That's probably only eight lengths between first and last. Anything could win it. Just dropping back towards the rear now. He's on Mellow Ounces and he's going to have to go a little bit wide unless he tucks himself over towards the row as we swing right handed as they go over the big ditch. And it's Blooming Chaser from Slip Anchor and May Secret. On the outside is Isabel Reform. We've still got a half a mile, over half a mile to travel as they start to swing right handed. The one that is going the longest way round is on Mellow Ounces. Going to lose a few uh, yards there. And it's Slip Anchor now and Blooming Chaser. These two head off for home first by length and a half. Hardy of course come off the rail now and starts to throw down a challenge as we're inside the final half mile. But Blooming Chaser and Slip Anchor running them down well is Hardy of course. As they go to the 23rd, there's a little bit of a slow jump by Blooming Chaser. So it's Blooming Chaser, Hardy of course, Slip Anchor. So Blooming Chaser and Hardy of course. Might be able to forget the rest inside the two and a half. It's Hardy Accord, Blooming Chaser, Slip Anchor. The West are still trying to run on, but it's Hardy Accord by a length. Goes over the 24th. So we've only got one to jump into a length and a half on Blooming Chaser as they swing right handed again with a furlong and a half to go. It's Hardy Accord and Blooming Chaser. Slip Anchor still in third. Tambra still trying to run on. On Mellow Ounce has got nothing left. Southern Spectrum. So it's Hardy Accord inside the final furlong. Hardy Accord by a length and a half on Blooming Chaser. It's Hardy Accord coming down to the last. Blooming Chaser. Chaser steadies himself, gets over it well, but he's not away from it fast enough. It's hardly a run in here. We've lost uh, not now, never. It's going to be a win for Hardy Accord. And Blooming Chaser in second, running on well for third was Tambra. Fourth was our long-time leader, Slip Anchor. Ooh, uh, the first three there. Or four, never short. Sure. We'll qualify. Hardy Accord, a couple of lengths away from his rival, Blooming Chaser. Running on well was Tambra for Paul Rhodes, but they were a further five lengths behind. So James Shea takes it. Well done. Second was Blooming Chaser for Darren Thompson. Third was Tambra for Paul Rhodes. Fourth was Slip Anger for Paul O'Neill. And Ember's legend February was fifth for Graham Clutterbuck.